So what is up guys, it's here George, so I'm back with another video of the best $2000 PC build. It's unlike my other videos, I love going with these types of videos that's the mid-range mid priced videos. Because as you know, my older videos was about the $11,000 and $17,000 PC builds and setups. So this is, this would be the better one for the people searching for mid-priced gaming PCs. So let's get started. So as you see for the CPU it's an Intel Core i7 7700K 4.2 GHz. It is one of the best processors out there because it is a 4.2 GHz that can overlock to 4.5 GHz. So it's probably one of the best 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 CPUs it do support the 64 gigs of mem memory and it's a 4 cores CPU for the cooler we're going to go with the normal cost Corsair H100i it's uh, 240 millimeter liquid cooling system and it's a really good one that is compatible with mostly every single CPU for the motherboard, we're going to go with an ASUS Trix Z270 It is a really really nice motherboard with a cool RGB lighting And it's also known for the heavy duty and it supports lots of good CPUs such as the one we're using um, It got a 4 uh, 4 storage, uh, 4 memory, RAM slots and it is a really good motherboard that I recommend for most of the gamers for the memory we're gonna go with a 32 gigs Corsair Dominator Platinum it's a 3200 memory that is a super fast that I'd recommend also for the other people to use because it got the 3200 speed it's probably one of the fastest out there uh, it is a 4 times 8 gigs RAM for the storage we're going to go with a 250 gigs Samsung 850 Evo series for the system and for the memory we can for I mean for the rest of the things we're gonna go with two two terabytes Seagate Barracuda hard drives it is a really good and fast hard drive that I recommend for everyone to use for the video card we got a beast at 8 gigs ASUS GeForce GTX 1070 video card it is one of the best video cards out there and for me it is one of the top 5 best video cards in the shops it is 8 gig video card that have a 1.6 3 gigahertz and 1.8 gigahertz of overlock it do support lots of lots of games while playing with ultra high sceneries settings that i also recommend for the people to use because it is a really good and not that expensive a video card for the case this time we're going with a Corsair 760T black or like it doesn't matter you can go with a black or white but I'd go with a black case it is a really good case that is uh, that got a really uh, big spaces that can fit our whole set For the power supply, we're going with a course uh, CXM 750 watts bronze 30 by 7 modular ATX power supply. Yep, uh, yep, yep, yep. So it is a 750 watts power supply that is compatible with our set. It got a whole black theme for the people that like black things. I mean, black themes for their setup. 
it can keep us in the safe side with the 750 watts and all we need is for, for 400 about 400 watts but for with the 7550 we can stay in the safe side um i wish you guys enjoyed this video again please do not forget to like share and subscribe and if you want me to do other videos i wish you can just comment and i'll try making as much videos as i can thank you